Hello everyone. Got a new base today. Um yeah, let's just hop right into it. So the exteriors, this is what it looks like. Um a lot to do with stability in the space. Primarily I had windows like this with the half half wall window, right? And then I've made a full wall window in order to make these peaks, which are pretty nice once we get to the roof. I will show you that. Come in here, we've got our main place to shoot out of. Uh, each of those can actually have this added. Fortunately, once you build them, you can't actually add them. And I'm fucking shit up. So, I'm just gonna stop fucking shit up and go upstairs. Main entryway, front door right here. Um, the other side is a hop up to shooting floor. You've got obviously your peak down. You don't add your peak down to your circle base. Uh, I don't know what you're doing with your life. Got extra protection for shooting. We've got a loot room, and we've got a loot room, and we've got this would be another loot room. Um, I don't know why I made it a hop up. I should change it, but uh, it's a loot room. A loot room. A loot room. Uh, anybody who gets to this point in your base is obviously very committed, um, but now they need to commit an extra 24 rockets to get to your TC, and they might not have that on them. So, you to get to your TC, it's just a simple place of a box and then you can store extra components down here um, and yeah that's a fun little TC 20,000 stone so you can see build costs on the right honestly 66,000 stone 80,000 metal and only 168 high qual which is really nice because the only thing you need to high qual is this there you go. Um, yeah. From there up, it's honestly just your average base. You've got rooms here. Again, this does not need to be a hop-up. This could be a bedroom right here. There's so much that you could do with that space. Protect hop-up. This should go into there. I'm not sure what this is. I'm, I'm not sure what my brain did here. <laughs> that should... Ah, that hurts my brain. Um, you know, you know what I'm doing here. Like, got your loot room. Got your door. And then, honestly, any of these could be your hop-up into your open court I have there. Except for this one. That one cannot be your hop up. Well, oh. okay. My brain is wired today. I don't know what it's doing, but we're doing it. You get up to your open core, however you want to get up here. Um, this is a shooting floor, so if you wanted to make your hop-ups through here, here, even something like this, all is good in the hood. Here are your peak downs. These peak downs are far more effective when you don't add stability. Um, I don't think I need to add these here. Yeah, we good. Um, these peak downs are... Nasty. So you can use this gap along that wall and just shuffle until you see them and then take them out. Uh, pretty much no matter where they blow through, these gaps can cover it. 
all the way up to your wall. And then the next one, all the way up to your wall. So, um, that is shooting floor and open core. Of course, got all the turrets, all your nice stuff. Pop up. Uh, another bedroom for anybody who needs to wake up. And your roof. Your roof is just a general roof. Um, there should be this here, but I broke something down below, you know. So, that covers your, your peak downs, your angles. And then it should be capped off like this. But here's how you hop up to your roof for all your helicopters and whatnot. And that is the base. I have these here. I planned on putting turrets in this um, just to be annoying. <laughs> but I figured out that putting them down there is much more effective. And then it saves you the ability to shoot out through this angle. And shoot down on everybody. These peaks are fun too. They're, those are nasty. Nobody's gonna see you or even hit you. Like that's that's a tight angle. Anyways, that is the bunkered base. I'm just gonna call this one orange because for some reason these blocks like being orange. So, this is the orange. <laughs>